Hi everybody, I'd like to share a few trades posted by our instructors and also graduated students globally on several uh, instruments and derivatives on the 8th of June 2022. The first clip is from Ren, uh, who has developed uh, a program that can screen for the first four algo. So Ren is, is a good programmer and global instructor and uh, shows in this clip how his algo detected on these three time frame, eight hours, one hour, five minute as a macro structure and trading charts, uh, a signal on the gopher pair, which is USD Japanese yen. And let me forward, fast forward his clip. So the signal came here, uh, but it wasn't exactly uh, before where it was uh, close to the middle of channel, so he waited for the setup to get confirmation. You see the structure, the macro is uptrend. Let me go fast forward. The structure is uptrend, and the trading chart is uptrend. So the first three algo pass momentum is also good, but uh, he waited for this price to go down to the oversold area and good risk to reward ratio and then took the trade manually with proper position size. So position size is very important in terms of money management because the system have 80% win rate but those 20% that uh, person lose money and uh, face the stop loss, the size should be proper and risk management need to be adjusted in a way that the drawdown of the account is low and nobody face their risk of ruin. So with proper risk management, with this system, 80% win rate and good win to loss ratio, because now the average wins on all these trades are around this much and uh, losses this much with 80% win, that's gonna give very good uh, uh, expectancy and also uh, is going to have no risk of ruin. Also, Ren took this trade on his system, uh, checking the, let me check, I think it's US 500, which is SMP CFD, and you see these are the time frames 3 hours, 30 minutes, 5 minutes, they're all. Up, uh, uptrend well aligned. Entry signal came here. He waited for the pullback to be completed. Took the uh, position here with the initial stop loss and profit targets. All of these are according to the lessons on exit strategy three. Very low risk scenario. And he took the trades. And let me fast forward. He's explaining the algo to his students. And the five algo passed. Entry signal is correct, risk per reward correct, everything is fine according to the path system. So, uh, very good average win to loss, very good high percent win. Thanks, Ren, for sharing these nice trades. Uh, the next two trades were shared by Kastrock, uh, our global instructor. So, KF shared this trade on NASDAQ showing the entry chart. And as you see, this is a smaller time frame and that you can see the uh, rejection at this level and these levels that were support before. So because it's got rejected, we see again downtrend forming and then we can find the range of channel and entry area. So, and the stop loss, so he entered here uh, based on rejections here and the price is closing below all these levels and then <coughs> the stop loss initially was here and then he's trailing that toward this target which is the previous uh, support area and so far you see this is end of his clip and so the 
the person win is uh, good when he follows the trend and it's more than 60 percent when it's on the sideway because his advanced trader he takes both sideway and trends so initial risk was this much and so far the profit is this much and the next trade by kf is so it's it is this area that he is shorting nasdaq uh, you see one minute chart now so it's very small but you can see that the rejection in this area has started to show a momentum towards downtrend with this channel then uh, it took a nice area here and then trail it and now he got and we play his video got a pretty large win to loss ratio uh, with this initial risk uh, maybe the risk was around here at the beginning just a second but he trailed it now to here and the reward is so far this much so thanks KF for sharing these nice trades with all the students so then uh, Yan or global instructor shared this clip on the futures contract of S&P and as you see here is his structural chart 60 minute uh, sorry, the macro is 60, structural about 1,000 tick, entry chart, which is trading chart about 50 tick. And you see the channel is correct. We have high probability trading area in the middle here. And you enter trade with good stop loss and reach the post target in this trade and also two targets in this trade. And uh, that was his takeout for the day. So this is actual futures contract that is regulated and is traded on the exchange uh, using good brokers and also softwares. Uh, you can see the results here. And then AP or global the graduate students share this trade again. Same, this is the same area that uh, KF shorted the uh, NASDAQ. So this is NASDAQ CFD. You see here his chart, 4 hours, 30 minute and 1 minute entry. Uh, he saw rejection here and aiming to get the first target here. Very good risk to reward ratio, this initial risks. And so far this is his reward, but aiming for this one. And if it, he trails this to see when the cut line breaks and exits so he's uh, still holding the position from this channel here <coughs> from this down channel here so thank you AP and everyone for sharing your nice trades with the students hope these are useful for everyone and let us know if you have any questions have a wonderful day